So if you've ever been in a situation where you're looking to capture or play back video, but in a very confined environment, what this product does, the Ultra Studio Mini Monitor, gives you the ability to be able to monitor out over Thunderbolt and then to SDI or to HDMI. So to give you a scenario, this could be the perfect example where you're editing in a hotel room in the middle of nowhere, but yet you want to use a monitor on the wall in the hotel. So what you can do is you can take HDMI out of this small box straight to that monitor on your wall, but then using that Thunderbolt connection, use that to connect that video back out to the monitor. On the reverse side, we actually have the Ultra Studio Mini Recorder, which does, the vi which does vice versa. So we can actually bring in SDI video, we can bring in HDMI video and capture via um, Thunderbolt. Now what also is amazing about this product is it's only 125 euros, which means that not only is it compact in size and gives you the ability to be able to put this in your laptop bag, but also it's an affordable cost to pretty much everybody. We anticipate this is going to be delivering towards the end of the year. One of the announcements at IBC this year which we're really pleased to announce is um, the Ultra Studio 4K. Um, what you'll see here with this device is it's one new breakout box um, which has a whole series of connections there for pretty much every scenario. You have everything from analog all the way up through to SDI. You have support there also for um, 3D SDI. Um, you've got quad link um, uh, output from there via four SDI channels, which means that you can actually play back 4K video footage directly from this unit. The way this connects to your PC or your Mac is actually via Thunderbolt. Now in this case at the moment we're only supporting Mac over Thunderbolt um, and that's through this small Thunderbolt connection here on the back of the unit. On the front of the unit we have a small LCD. This LCD is showing the video footage that is coming through. We're actually playing 4K on this monitor behind and you can see that 4K image actually on the small LCD at the front. If you have different connections of video coming through you can select obviously HDMI there, you can also select analog and also select AES and embedded audio too.